poor girl. She doesn't know what she's doing. Outlander, have you met Logra, the chief's daughter? She has a fascination with the lives of adventurers like you. It's unfortunate. As chief daughter, her duty is to be wed to another clan, to forge an alliance. Some seek to escape this honor. Lokra is on the verge of such a mistake. Perhaps you could dissuade her. It is because you are not of our clan that she might listen to you. If she departs without the blessing of the clan, she will be in exile. We cannot lose our only daughter, nor is Lokra ready to face the life of the clanless. No mystery where to find Lokra. Check the docks. She'll be there, staring at your ship, if she hasn't already snuck aboard. Moloch's hand, no. If she were, we would not have these troubles. She is the daughter of Shog, Tazgol's hearthwife. That one's softness has made Lokra selfish and difficult. I pay her no mind. I only wish I'd given Tazgol a daughter. My boys are strong, but the clan needs more daughters. Rarely does a clan permit a daughter to leave, and never without cause. Lokra is the chief's only daughter. We need her to do her duty. If she leaves without permission, well, clanless life is never easy. Most outsiders view orcs as savage beasts. We have many enemies. We must be harsh to survive. Keep your weapon sheathed, newcomer. You were among the crew that arrived with Lambour, yes? I envy you. Free to see the world and make of your life whatever you wish. Shackles are not always made of iron. My destiny was decided when I was born a female. As the Chief's only daughter, my duty is to marry into another clan, forging an alliance. It is our way and my fate. If only I had the courage. I want nothing more than to see the world before I marry. But I can't. Not without the blessing of my mother and grandmother. Go ahead. It won't do any good. Orc clans survive this way for many generations. It's simply how things are. I understand that, as much as it angers me. Of course. But that would mean abandoning my clan. I understand the importance of our traditions. I must be sure I'm doing the right thing. The clan chief is the only male who takes wives. The wives are crucial to the leadership and stability of the clan. Sons eventually try to take over the clan by strength, while daughters are married off to other clans. It's not that. I would enjoy the honor and responsibility of being a chief's wife. I just want to see the world, to live my life before I marry for the good of the clan. Greetings, friend of Lambor. How can an old orc help you? I sense Lokra found an ally in you. But your efforts are for naught. I cannot determine her path, nor can her mother or my son, the chief. Only Lokra can decide. Her sense of duty battles her desire to live her life. Many daughters have chosen exile over the years. I did once. While the decision is Lokra's alone, she seems to value your advice. She wishes to be free of guilt. She knows what she wants, but fears the consequences. 
Choices always come with a price. Locre must choose and accept the cost. To follow her heart. Locre knows what she wants, and she knows the cost. She wants to be free, but fears exile from the clan. Her heart knows the path she should follow. Something doesn't add up here. Is there a reason you're in the Chief's chambers? If not, be on your way. You met my daughter then. She has spirit, I'll give her that. She'll make a worthy wife. So, she sent you to argue for her. She knows her duty, it is our way. The alliance her marriage makes for our clan will enable us to survive in these dangerous times. She is the Chief's only daughter. I would rather her be miserable and alive than dead on some fool adventure. But I don't expect an outsider to understand. Our lives belong to the clan. Its survival depends on marriage alliances more than strong sword arms. Locra must accept her part and perform her duty. If you want to help, remind her of this. Maybe she'll listen to you. I assume my family wasn't especially pleased with an outsider prying into our affairs. Remember, it was your idea. So what's your opinion, after talking to everyone? I really want to know. You're right. I value my family. But this is my life. I should live it as I choose. I'm gonna follow my heart. At last, I find myself looking forward to my future. Yes. I'll say my farewells first. It won't be easy, but I won't sneak out like a thief. My family has a right to hear it from my lips. I'll see you on the ship when you're ready to leave. <laughs> 